Hey guys, I'm Rehan, and in this video, I will show you how to create a single activity application. Let's start. Okay, uh, here, first of all, I need three D's a library for navigation component. Okay, I added. And also, I want to add a view binding. Okay. Um, if you don't uh, know anything about view binding, uh, don't worry. I uh, attached the link in the description about my last tutorial about view binding. I uh, explanation totally about. Uh, view binding and use it in activity fragments and adapter uh, i suggest uh, and you can see it okay uh, everything that we need i added here and here and start to sync okay our uh, syncs is successfully now i want to add a tree fragment first fragment a uh, second fragment sorry my okay now I can do it second fragment and another one I want to add third fragment okay our fragments uh, are ready just uh, I can delete this one because I don't want have them okay here and I do same thing for my second okay and the last one yet i don't need them okay so delete it okay now i i should create it a nav uh, uh navigation component xml okay how like this one you just need create a resource with type of navigation and so here I put a name you can uh, type every name that you want here uh, I just see this one here I have my uh, navigation component and here I just need to add my fragment you can see here My first fragment, my second fragment, and my last fragment. Okay, first of all, and I guess it's need to explanation about this icon. This icon that means uh, which fragment uh, is a start your destination for navigation component. You can change it easily. Just need. Uh, that fragment you want to start your destination from that selected for example here I want to set second fragment for my start destination just select it and click on the home icon here you can see it's changed okay and also here and you can uh, set your action uh, I mean uh, action uh, something like that you want to go to which ac activity uh, from uh, from which one to which one uh, you can set it uh, with this icon the circle you can see when I click it and drag it uh, with this line I can 
uh, manage my uh, direction uh, action actually you know you can see here uh, create action automatically uh, that action calls first fragment to third fragment and also I can add this one for this and also uh, something like that okay uh, this action means I want to go from my first fragment to third and second fragment and also I back uh, from second fragment to first fragment okay um, for now uh, everything is done here and just need to uh, set all of these uh, into my main activity uh, before that I want to add some button to my fragment to adding this direction on it and you can see how it's work uh, for saving time uh, I create uh, a simple so simple uh, XML for each one uh, the first fragment I put it uh, here to a uh, bottom for go to second fragment and go to third fragment and also as well for second fragment and uh, third fragment okay uh, in the activity main XML I should to put uh, something like that here okay we can see the start destination shows here and that means everything is okay uh, now we need to put some code here on view created uh, first of all I need add view binding here Binding for yes here and here sorry inflate uh, inflator and container and the last one false and here we should add this one okay we winding added in our binding dot btn go to we need call set on click listener okay here uh, we have a code simply code actually for going to a uh, second activity and the code is here yes navigation okay r dot id dot okay you can see um uh, that line connected to uh, th this line i mean you can see here okay oh it's okay um i want from the first fragment go to second fragment i choose it just that and i can do it for my another okay set on click listener on navigation controller navigation and on it I just need to add first fragment to third fragment okay uh, I stop uh, the recording until my emulator uh, is running uh, okay also I can add it, this kind of things to my uh, here I can add it uh, private latinate web bonding uh, for yes here and 
it's here choose it yeah inflate inflator container and the last one I put it there false here root okay and here I can Binding dot btn go to first dot set on oh sorry set on click listener and here on navigation navigation and here are the id dot I'm in second navigation and I want to go to first navigation here yes and just that I can also edit for the third fragment private latin var binding for third fragments and here inflator inflate inflator container and also oh sorry false yeah and binding here dot root and also i should oh sorry okay and binding dot btn dot set and click listener and as well i added this code or that id dot uh, I want to yeah here okay everything is done now we can test our application okay yeah Yes, you can see here uh, when I clicked and go to second activity, uh, it should be go there. I click and can, yes, you can see it. Uh, my the second fragment, yes. And when I uh, click to go back, yes, do that. Third, yeah, okay just that so simple uh if you like my video please uh, like it leave me comment and also uh, you can subscribe my channel for upcoming video thank you for watching this video